Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls for Alpha 20 series. It is the morning of day 58. I have no idea if we're getting a horde tonight, but we have loaded up a bunch of gear to take over to the horde base. We're going to go do that first, but before we do that, we're going to have a look at our skill points here. We've picked up 11 skill points. Now, I want to go into technology crafting. We do have one more book, but we can't get this until we are level what? 150. I think we're pretty darn close. 149. So we should be able to get that today. Now that's going to be... How many points is that? Um, doesn't say. I think it's like four points though. Now we do have a book, which I might save... Actually, you know what? Let's read that book now. That's going to save those points. Where are you here? Uh, there it is there. So that'll save those points. Later on we'll have a lot more. Because I want to spend these points on other stuff right now. So... So that will be ready by the time we get uh, the next level. So we can make laser gear. Now the only problem, the only thing that's bottlenecking us right now is a laser workbench. I looked into a few things. Um, we can't do any of these, uh, where are we here? We can't do any of these physical conditioning shots because it requires a laser workbench, which we don't have. I did find the laser battery mod and that requires a laser multi-tool which means we need to have the laser workbench for that forged titanium uranium so we're going to need to get some of these things from the wasteland today so i geared up today ready to do that now we've got um our gear on where are we here here uh to go to the wasteland so we have all of our radiation gear on you notice down here we have 100 percent radiation protection. So we're going to do that after we go over to the horde base and do some minor upgrades. Now I brought the junk drone. We're going to have some healing on that thing. We'll be running with that when we're in the wasteland. I have no idea what to expect. It might be easy. It might not be easy. I mean, I, I, don't, I don't know what to expect. We're just going to go test it out. I'm going to go look, skirt the border of the, the wasteland for uranium and titanium. It should show up on the map. Now nah, I'm going to murder these guys down here real quick. Actually, after we spend our points. So let's go and do that. Now, uh, before we do too much here, let's see what our loot stage is. So we're pretty good, actually. Loot stage is 443. So it's not too, too bad. Once we get to the wasteland, it'll be a lot higher, but it's going to be really irrelevant because there's not going to be much stuff down there to loot. Because uh, we're not going to be planning on going into any towns or anything. Uh, we're at 6155 kills, 7 player kills, which are those just wandering survivors and zero deaths. 307 game stage, which isn't too, too bad. It should be interesting. I think 300 game stages when the uh, the radiated uh, zombies, or not radiated, the um, demons show up. All right. Well, with that problem solved, let's deal with. Oh, we got some bags. Four bucks. I think this was was this for the spider from last night. There was a bunch of stuff out here last night. Three bones. You know what? Let's just pitch that. We don't need it. We got so much... <laughs> if I need bones, I can collect them off the front yard here. Oh, that's gotta suck, buddy. Hey, lady. Ooh, see ya. Um, we got one across the street here. Alright, we gotta spend our skill points still, or I'm gonna forget. Another 16 bucks. Alright, so... We've got 11. 12 now. Oh, we went up in level. Beautiful. So, we should have, uh, yeah, technology crafting four. Laser carbon. We can't make any of this stuff until we get the laser workbench. So, I don't know if we're going to hold out and hopes that Jen has it or we have to go down and, like, I mean, we got to go down to the uh, bunker. So, we're going to have to go and do that at some point. Uh, so, what do we want to spend? So, actually, you know what? Let's go to the horde base first and then I'll spend these points. All right, here we go. Now we should be pretty good here. I haven't like recorded in a week or so, so I just want to double check. I did watch the last episode. I just wanted to make sure that we got everything. What am I missing? Oh, yeah. There's still a few blocks here that need to be uh, updated. Let me just do that real quick. Okay, we got 96 more blocks we can update. Let's do. I mean, these guys have been fine all along, but oops, a little too fast there. Yeah, like there's a bit of, not much, but a bit of splash damage along here too. So I wonder if I should, 
Hmm. No, I think we'll hold off upgrading the wall parts. We don't have any uh, concrete on us. Concrete and uh, concrete. That'll help that out. Yeah, that's um. Let's do these two. That'll help that out. We're looking pretty good here, I think. Maybe I'll just hold on to the rest of the steel for repairs for next time. How much do we have here? Well, we still got a fair bit. Um, I don't know. I guess I... I you know what? Hmm. Ah, you really should just do all of this. Right, that's got the stairs done. Uh, let's get this part done here. I'm sure I'll regret if I don't do that. I think that's probably pretty good. I mean, all the high damage areas are taken care of now. So let's hang on to the rest of that. I mean, we burned through a lot of steel. This is all done, right? Yeah, we're all good here. Okay. Feeling pretty good about that. Let's drop off what we need to drop off here. And I'm going to drop this stuff in here because we don't need it right now. I don't want to be taking that to the wasteland with me. Alright, so I think that's what we do. We just go down to the wasteland now. I don't think we're getting a horde today, which is beautiful. I'm really nervous about this. I don't know how well... This is going to go. The wasteland's bad enough without Feral Sense on, but with it on, ah, it's even worse. Actually, let's have a look at the map here. Alright, we're going to probably want to go down to Rex Town, I think. Where is he? I mean, we could, or we could just go down here. Let's go down here. Worst case scenario, we could always stay in one of the houses down there tonight. Mine some iron. Alright, well, here we are. I'm interested to see how nasty this will get with Feral Sense on. Yeah, they're on me already. There's a demon portal. So there's most probably all going to be runners in here. Grab those. Let's just kill this guy so he doesn't sneak up on me. Oh man, the spear. Oh, hey! Alright, we got a demon portal. Let's have a look at the map and see if there's any uh, nodes on here. Now, I think it's the dark. There's like a dark blue and then the different colors are green. So these are iron nodes. I mean, I guess we could just kind of drive along the edge here to see if we can find anything on the edge of the... Uh, Wasteland to go mining with. Not interested in taking out a portal at this moment. We don't need de demonic essence either, so... Well, oh, that's like right next to the, uh... Right next to the edge. Okay. Not seeing anything. Another runner. Nothing immediately there. Still nothing. Let's cross this river, I guess. Oof. Right into a tree. That would kind of be a cool, uh... I don't think I've ever seen that POI before. That's kind of a cool POI. Comes a white. I never did spend my. Ow! Never did spend my points. Oh, 
What is this place? Demon? Thought maybe it might have been a Darkness Falls added uh, POI, but I don't think so. Fuck off, Mo. A spider. So far it hasn't been too bad, but we're not by demon portals, so... Oh, hey big mama. Gotta come at me with more juice than that. Now, are you... I think that's just a regular biome boulder. We'll hit, the, hit that in a second here and find out. Now this should go pretty quick here. Oh my god. Three hits. Yeah, it's a regular biome boulder. Alright, let's keep going. Oh, hey guys. What's up? I mean, I can understand you being upset about me ruining your day and all, but... Oh, here comes somebody from over there, too. I don't see anything there. Hey, Kenny. Oh no, you didn't hit my truck, did you? Where the hell'd you go? Got a piece of me, too. Now we got a couple of officers here. Looking a little bit upset at me perhaps driving off main road. Ow. Alright, what do we got here? That's a gray boulder. It's like a blue color we're looking for. I wonder if we should hit this road. Hmm, I think we're getting close to the edge of the map too. Let's just go along here. Maybe we get lucky. If not, I look for a road. Oops, excuse me. She dropped a bag, but it's a normal big mama, so I'm not going back for it. Yeah, so it looks like we're at the edge of the map here. Let's have a look here. Yeah, hmm. Alright, well I'm not 100% thrilled with the idea of having to drive into the wasteland here, but there is a road, like, right here. Yeah, fuck off. So let's see if we can get to that road. I mean, it doesn't look as to be as bad here as some of the other places crossing the wasteland. Alright, let's go along here and see what we can find. Hello, goodbye. Uh, let's not stop next to the demon portal. That's not a good idea. Alright, anything along the way here? Nope. Although the one good thing about being on this road is that that's widening. It shouldn't reach a town or something up here. Okay, I don't see anything there. Okay, still don't see anything. What's up, buddy? I think I brought- oh man, I didn't bring enough gas. We're definitely gonna have to stop at some point and get gas. That should be interesting. I don't see anything there. Well, we got a highway here. I still don't see anything. Oh, hey buddy. See ya. You might be able to catch me on foot, but you sure as hell ain't catching me in this truck. Excuse me. Alright, anything back there? No, there's a nice lake here though. Maybe we should build a, uh, a beachfront property here. That would be an interesting playthrough. Start off with radiation-ready mods, and, uh... 
have to live in the wasteland. Beachfront property. Somehow you survived the nuclear fallout and... I, you know, I don't know what I was expecting. I was really hoping we would find... Plutonium or titanium somewhere on the map. I wonder if I'm going to have to get out and just like... Dig. It's supposed to show up. I do have the latest version installed, so... I know originally it didn't have everything. Oh, there's, there's a town here. It didn't have the, the dots marked on the map, but now it does. Let's see if there's a trader. I wonder how, how fast the trader would get destroyed here. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. I think I drove over him in the... Whoa! That came out of nowhere. I drove over him and my tires flicked him up into the air. Oh shit, there's a demon portal right next to her house. Uh... Yeah, they're already coming out of there. So I ain't uh, staying here. This place is gonna get trashed. I wonder what this town's like. Okay, it's just a small town. At least it is this part. I gotta get out of here. I can't stay in the town. Okay, this is a bad idea. This is not a good idea. This is a death trap. Let's just find the main road. I mean, it's not really a death trap. I mean, it is if I want to burn through all of my ammo. But I don't want to do that. So that kind of road kind of ends there. Oh man, okay. I don't want to go back either. We've already combed, covered that area. Let's go along the edge of the town here. Well, I don't know what to do now. Where does this road go? Ah, uh, back to the main highway. Although this main highway goes where? Is this the one we were on before? It is. Damn. I mean, I guess we could go... Yeah. Excuse me. Come on, you fuckers. Get out of my way. So this road goes north. Oh, hey, what's up, buddy? So let's go north. Yeah, I see the back end fishtail in there. So when you put it on turbo, it just, once it reaches max speed, it kind of fishtails. Better not end here. It shouldn't. Not with the row being that thick. Alright, now. Uh, still not seeing anything. Alright, let's just stop here for a second. I'm interested. Yeah, that's just... Landscape. Landscape. Alright, well... Yeah, it's probably right. I probably need to find the uh, ones that are properly marked. So... That's not marked as anything. Oh, that's titanium. do that for a second. Yeah, see, I had the spear. That zombie took damage before I even swung. Let's see if we can grab a bit of here. I'm really nervous about this, though. As long as we keep the car next to us. I should just put the junk turrets down. Yeah, that's probably a better thing. Feeling abnormally quiet. Uh, 
That was a bird. Yeah, with Feral Sense on, it just makes me really worried. Yeah, they didn't weren't even, even able to kill her. Like if we get a demon. It's nice that I'm getting a lot of one hits now too. It's saving me so much time. Alright, we got 6k. Uh, what do I want to do here? I'd like to find a mine that's closer to my place. That sounded like a lot of footsteps to me. Alright, let's make sure we mark this on the map though. Oh yeah, there it is right there. So that did give us the... Uh... It did give us the right color. Uh, let me get a bit more. Worst part about this is worrying about a wandering horde. That would be the end of me at this point. In the wasteland. Yeah. That's the end of me. They catch me in this hole. Okay, we've almost got... I think we got 10,000. Let me double check here. We'll get out of here with 10. Now we got to find plutonium and uranium. Yeah, we're over 10. So that's probably pretty good for now. Let's grab you guys. Yeah, those demon portals being that close. Now, I know they respawn, so killing them won't make a difference. But let's get going. Leave the spear up. Let's go. All right, what's this one? So there's another titanium right there. Oh, wait. Is it? Or is that uranium? I thought it was different colors of green I was looking for. Come on, you fuckers. Let's go. You were hiding under the car. Well, these guys came out of nowhere. Damn it. Better make me play this, are ya? Didn't want to have to open up with a shotgun, but I guess we're gonna... Fuck you guys. Should have did that from the first from the get-go here. Let's just scrap that. Alright, regular idiots. Couple of more runners. Where was that boulder? Is it further out? Probably further out than I thought. Oh, I'm north of it. Oh, there it is right there. So with all the radiation ready stuff, I'm at 95 movement speed. 95%. That's titanium as well. I don't need to mark that. Actually, yeah, I don't need to mark that one. So 95% plus the 5% movement speed for their jacket, college jacket. And then the 10% from pork and shotgun puts us over 100%. Not as fast as I'd like to be, but it's still not bad. There's the uranium we need right next to two portals. Fuck me.
I wonder if we're far enough far enough away from that portal to not have anything spawn. That uh, doesn't look like it. For crying out loud. No, that's not a demon. Okay. Alright, we're going to have to kill this guy. I think we might be okay here. Now, I can't use this yet because we need a fusion forge. And I can't make a fusion forge until we have a uh, workbench, laser workbench. So, now I think, I don't know, the, Caitlin and stuff used to sell fusion forges. I don't know if she still does, though. That doesn't mind people very well. I mean, I guess we could go back to her place, dip in real quick, and hope that we can get in and out before we get murdered by that uh, porthole. Alright, let's get a bit of this if we can. Alright, before we go too crazy. Let's set you there. That should give me enough, I think, for a little bit. I hate the ambient sounds out here in the wasteland because it covers up footsteps. It's one of the reasons why I turn music off, too. I don't generally play with music on at all because it covers up, like... It basically gives the zombies a bit of stealth, which I'm not a big fan of. Like, ambient sound is fine because you expect it everywhere, and yeah, it will cover up sound of zombies' footprints. And I'm okay with that, but the music, it's like, nah. No music in real life. Yeah, so I was going to briefly talk about... I know I mentioned this earlier, I probably should have talked about it back then, but... I was watching Glock 9's most recent episode 22, I think, of his Father Glock series, which is Darkness Falls. And he's at a point now where there's not much the zombies can do to him. And he's at that point from multiple of reasons and it's reasons why I don't like uh, using certain skills so he's got um, he's gone knives which is fine but the issue is is now that he's using the laser sword and he's got um, the hell is that there's knife guy and then the, there's the other skill underneath it that actually at a certain point will give you regeneration with every hit like so heals you x amount per hit and that last episode episode 22 i'm not sure if you guys noticed it but i sure as hell noticed it it looks like he's not having any fun because he said multiple times through the episode these guys can't do anything to me there's no real threat i guess the only real threat left is the wasteland and he's 100 percent right it robs the fear of being killed because if you can use a melee weapon and regen hit points then you take like um what's it called uh flurry of blows you take all the major melee skills you become a beast and i totally okay i get that in game terms but like if you're trying to like play so that you have to worry about even at later stages potentially being killed then if you have oh that was a spike I should probably uh, not push my luck here. What do we got? Three grand. Let's take our uh, take our three grand and go. Let's mark this on the map, though. So we want to do save waypoint. This one. Yeah, I thought I felt a, a lag spike there. But I don't see any wandering horde. Alright, let's keep going down the road. So anyway, he's getting real bored. Like, I can tell. He wants to get the radiation ready gear. I don't think he realizes how long it's going to take to get that. Oh my god, this is the end game bunker. Shit, I didn't realize this is where I was headed. Well, we're not doing that now. I mean, I could, but... 
I don't have the... I, I mean, I'd be out of ammo way before we got to the end. So let's get back to the forest. Oh, excuse me. I think we did pretty well to get today with the titanium. I got to stop and get gas on the way home. Oh, hey, everybody. How's your... Uh, we got to go through that to get to the uh, bunker. Whoop. Look. Yeah, we're stuck. Come on, give me a push. Push ah, for fuck's sake. All right. Not gonna give me a push. Find my own way out. He's trying to give me a push. What am I stuck on? It can't be that. Ow! Fucking shoot me. Line up for me. Damn it. Well, they're all coming now. Can we move? We can. It was that. I think that's a wandering horde, actually. Yep, I think that's a wandering horde. Uh, I'm not taking you on in the wasteland. Get over here. Your friends didn't... Oh. Friends didn't come with you. Uh, let's see if we can take these guys on. Oh, he's coming. Uh, what is he doing? Yeah, that wasn't too bad. That was two demons. Oh, hey! Don't be angry. He's angry. That's a lot of hit points. Yeah, he was really angry. I don't understand why. I mean, what did I do to him? 42 bucks, eh? That was totally worth it. Oh, what do you got? Oh my god. <sighs> Sure, I got a little bit of ammo back. I'm not taking the rest of these guys on. It's wasting my time. Um, what was I saying? I don't know. Oh yeah, something about Glock and being like he—he he seems very bored now. And he's on day 21. Like, I mean, I think part of the issue is that he, like, the settings that he chose, I thought were like, if you're a noob, maybe, but. He's really good at playing, so I'm like, why would you go... Okay, 90 minute days I kind of get... You can get way more done in 90 minutes than you can, you know... Um, in like like a regular 60 minute day. I kind of get that. Okay, let me grant you that one. But then he's playing like Feral Sense off. Okay, sure. Um... But for, you, but for him, it's like, why wouldn't you play with something a little more challenging? I know it can turn into a kill fest. Like, that's what this series is right now. It's a kill fest. It's like you're just constantly murdering zombies, right? But, I mean, I don't know. I think he kind of, like, set himself up for that, being bored too early. That's why I think you need to play Darkness Falls, like, at least bare minimum on the standard days, you know. Especially if you're, if, like, if you're, like, he's a skilled player. So he's playing on a, like, like, if he was a new player, I could see him using those settings, but, I don't know. Just me, I guess. But now he's got this long haul to try and get radiation ready stuff, which he's not going to get. 
Not in any kind of short order, although he's been extremely lucky with, like, finding stuff. Oh yeah, he's also, um, increased the, uh... What? What was that? Let me just use this here real quick. What was I gonna say? It wasn't, like... The increased block damage, there was... That makes things quicker. And I, I get that for a series, it can make things quicker, it's probably okay. But I don't know, I think he's just made it so that he's gonna be bored real fast. Um, I gotta get gas. I'm wondering if he's gonna be in for a rude awakening once Behemoth starts spawning in, uh, POIs. I doubt it. I mean, like, he's... Like, like I said, he's a very skilled player. He knows what he's doing. He's gotten out of situations that, you know, I probably would have panicked in. Especially when you watch him play his other series. Yeah, you run. You run. Let's finish this up. I like that the multi-tool can do multiple things, but I don't like the fact that I can't power attack the, uh, the vehicles to, like, get gear off them. It just takes longer. I should just multi-tool you to death. Yeah, see, I hit her. I pulled the spear out, hit her, and then... I don't know, maybe she took retaliation damage, but she never did hit me, so I don't know how that would be a thing. Should be enough gas to get home. I got nothing in there. Oh, you're from the wasteland. Came all that way for nothing, buddy. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. So, th there's a few skills that I generally shy away from, and it's not because it, they don't contribute to a build. They definitely do. Like, things like, um, I think Snowby was was mentioning this too, using things like flurries of flurry of blows. It definitely does con contribute to a melee build. Like if you're like planning on doing a lot of meleeing, having flurry of flurry of blows is like it's really a no-brainer, right? I just don't use it because it just I don't know. It's too not too easy, but it's I guess it is just too easy. Like an additional, could you imagine with the spear? But we're one-shotting most zombies with now. 25% extra attack rate. The fact that I don't use any stamina now, I probably won't be using any stamina with even the plus 25% attack rate. So, I mean... I don't know. Let's have a look at our skills here. We're going to pull into the trader here. I'm going to try and sell some stuff to him. See if he's got anything important, and then we'll... Uh, Call it an episode, and I'll head home at night. Try and do some more, Smells some more like mining. Dysentery. Does it? I've got a bee outside. You know, I never even use my drone. I just forget. You know. Uh, okay, let's just use this. Let's not sell it. Oh, do you have anything good? Maybe I just buy all this seven six two. We didn't use any Molotovs today because there was no real need. Was there seven six two there? No. I mean, I guess I could go out to Caitlyn and see if she's got a fusion forge. Ah, good old wreck. Can always be counted on to buy soil from. That's cheap enough. It's hoping to be into solar by now, but I guess we had to buy the solar banks from, from Caitlyn out in the wasteland. She's got like that thing right next to her. I'll buy that so I don't have to mine it. More gunpowder? Ooh, I'll take your lead. Thank you. Um, I think I'm pretty good on clay. I can always come back and buy it off this guy if I had to. He's got a lot of clay. It's like 11 for 150. So... It's like 200 and something. That doesn't cost me much. I might as well do that. Uh, I'll do this so I don't have to buy or go out and get some more. 
sand so I don't have to use up my stone. What are we at now? A fair bit there still. Let's grab some coal. We can make gunpowder if we need to. Uh, actually, you got 153 duct tape. Not going to spend seven grand, but I will buy 50. Uh, no, I won't. We got. I just made glue. I don't need to do that. Anything good here? Not really. Hazmat fiber I don't need anymore, but I will look for it. I think I'm going to need military fiber, though. For the um, power armor. I think I need to make the power armor in the... Uh, Laser workbench. So maybe we ha maybe we do have to gear up and go do that bunker. I think we got to gear up and go do the bunker. We don't really have what I'd like to have to go in there, but I mean I think we're at a kind of a good position. There's not too many radiated zombies, but there'll be definitely inc incubi and things like that in there. So it should be an interesting fight. Uh, let's buy. Yeah. I mean, I got enough stuff at home to scrap, but I mean, I'll buy that. It's a little extra. Oh, take all your polymers. I never did get electrical parts. Do you have any electrical parts? You don't. Hmm. How much shotgun do we use today? Let's buy 23 rounds. Top that back up. So I feel like I don't, like I didn't waste anything today going down to the wasteland. Uh, electrical parts. Well, more polymers. That's a that's pricey for polymers, man. Wow. It's electrical parts I need now, though, more than anything. All right. Well, let's spend these skill points. Did we get another level today? I don't think so. I think we just got the one, right? No, we got oh my shit. We got a few more levels today. Uh. This is what, level 175? We're getting pretty close to being that maxed out. Yeah, you know what? We're probably going to have to go down after the next horde and do that bunker. Because if we don't, we're going to end up with like a lot of radiated or uh, starting to get a lot of demons in the horde base. And I won't have laser weapons to be able to handle them. So we're going to have to go down there. I'm going to have to make a laser workbench while I'm down there. So I'll bring the stuff with me to do that. That's generally what people do is they build it when, when it's down there. So, okay, so skills there is. Uh, well maintained is for tool reduction, degradation. I'm going to put two points into that. You heard me spending points. Dehydrate 50% less. Drug withdrawal symptoms, drugs are 10% more effective. I'm going to add one to that. For the de just for the de dehydration only. This is resistant versus infection. I mean, I guess I should be watching out for that. So there's Flurry of Blows. You start off with one. 5% increase attack speed. This gives you 25% more. You know. Wait. To clubs, brawling, knives, machetes, and stun batons. So I don't think this actually works for... Uh, excuse me for a second here. Well, you got something to say about it? You got something to say about it? I didn't think so. I didn't think so. Would you leave me here? Really? Past the point of needing any of that stuff, but I will fix this guy's place a little bit. There you go. Let's say I didn't do anything for you. Alright, what are we looking at here? So I guess Flurry of Blows is not going to help me with the spear. Spear's already pretty quick. Uh, we want this though. So the other thing is, where is it here? Blade Master, that's it. So, reduces incoming damage by 5%. Okay, I kind of see that, right? Guaranteed to uh, cause bleeding on your target with primary attacks. That's just the, the left click, right? Gain 10% 10, 10 damage with each kill, up to 30%, lasts for 20 seconds. That's not bad because if you're power attacking continuously, you'll be doing 30% damage in no time extra for... A long period of time. Gain two points in every sex successful attack. And then bladed weapon strike landed in a short time does 300% damage. So this is what he's getting. So he's attacking continuously and being hit. But he's like his hit points are going back up so quickly that it doesn't matter. Because he's just as long as he hits a zombie he's gaining hit points back. 
every time he swings. This is Glock, which is why I think he's not finding that much of a challenge. I thought this was a lot higher, but even two hit points, if you're hitting like you know 20 or 30 zombies, that's like 40 to 60 hit points back. So, it, and it adds up really quickly too, right? So that's the other thing. So that's maxed, shotgun's maxed, quality Joe is maxed. Uh, rifles, I don't know if we're gonna be going with laser rifle. Probably not gonna be bothering at all. I'm not gonna put any points into that. We could go with parkour. Oh, this doesn't really matter. I mean, it does in the case of um, like your first shot, but with Feral Sense on, it's from the shadow, shadows becomes a very difficult proposition, which is why I don't spend any points in it. And parkour, I mean, while it's okay, nerd pulling with parkour becomes hard, but I mean, I guess it's okay. I'll definitely be using this when we did when we take uh, in this series. I'm going to be taking on a uh, a horde on foot. We'll be I'll, I'll use I'll spend points in this later to get that up, but uh, right now I'm not going to bother. So is there anything here? This is all maxed. Iron gut wouldn't be too too bad. Lock picking no big deal. We're not using that anymore anyway. Okay, we got the powered range traps maxed out. There's nothing crafting wise I want here. So farmers maxed except for max master farmer. Secret recipes, boost stats, black shop copy. So this will give you the, the food that gives you uh, better loot bonuses and things like that. Although the hunter gives us the extended magazine, I think I really want that. That's gonna help a fair bit when we get down later on. Master laborer, we're done. Mechanic. I, I mean, it gives us the vehicles, but with this pickup truck, I'm kind of happy with it. I mean, I could make them rotter before we go to the uh, the bunker, but the truck seems to be going just fine through the wasteland. This gives us better loot. This is just a general military fibers. I don't know, man. Maybe we do go... Hmm. We're not using very many pills, but... Drug withdrawal. 90% less. So I'll probably be using the um, Fort Bites in the end bunker. Let's go that route. Uh, this is less chance to get effect infected. Actually, you know what I want to do? I want to go this route. What do we got left? Five? Yeah, 50% more damage. Yeah, we'll go this route. Because I got a feeling we're going to need to blast through those some of those doors because there's going to be so many zombies behind it. Anyway, I'm going to end this episode here. Um, when we come back next episode, uh, I'll be at home We'll probably do some work in the morning around the house. Uh, I might take a look at the, like, the structural integrity of the house. Uh, I got some concrete moving before I left, so I'll turn those into blocks and just repair the house. And maybe we figure out what we're going to do for the farm. And then if we know if we're getting a hoard or not. If we get the hoard, well, we'll stay at the house and work on the house. If we don't get a hoard, then I don't know. I might take another trip back to the wasteland and see what we can do there when we're there. But I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And please drop your comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.